Tubes. Hello. Welcome to Dow Jones, home of the Wall Street Journal. I am Wendy Bounds. I'm an editor here at the Journal. I also host our daily news and lifestyle show, WSJ Lunch Break. This is 1211 Avenue, the Americas. Our neighbors in the building are the New York Post, Fox News. Let me take you inside. one of our legendary standing receptionists. You do stand all day, right? Well, we do rotate. You rotate, but hence the flats. All right, this is the reception area. This is where everybody comes when they first come to Dow Jones. And I love it not just for the standing receptionist, but for the chandelier, because every newsroom needs a chandelier. And we have one. This is where WSJ is. This is where Barron's, Factiva, all of our brands are housed. And the reason I love the chandelier, I'm going to touch it, no, alarm, no alarms went off, I think I'm good, is because it tweets, as do many inanimate objects here in the building. And if we ever decided to have a dinner party, we'd be set. Dow Jones has 5,000 employees worldwide, but here in the News Corp building, we take up the fourth, fifth, sixth, and seventh floor. This is the open floor plan. Everybody can see everything everybody else is doing. They can see their computer screens. They can see what she's ordering on eBay. That's really cute. I, I, I bid on that. <laughs> Right. Lex, our CEO, he sits right over there, and it's no uh, accident that he sits in the middle of the customer service department. He even likes to take phone calls himself sometimes. We can never forget we're in the customer service, and you know how? Because we have this sign. This is a WSJ snack bar, and if we ever do have a dinner party, this is going to be a pretty good place to start. Look, I'm, I'm stocking up because it gets a little competitive in the afternoons. Not as competitive, though, is the tweeting war between the snack bar and the New York Times refrigerator at NYT Fridge. Secretly, between you and me, I think they're in love. And jealous. We've only got 30 minutes. All right, this is one of our conference rooms, okay? This is where all the action happens. They time everything so you don't stay in a meeting too long. Everything here is named after real estate. This is Nolita. I'm exhausted. We just came from the Lower East Side. It's called a huddle room, not to be confused with a cuddle room. I haven't seen any cuddling going on, really, HR, I promise. All right. Oh, I've got 29 minutes left. I'm good. Keep going now. This is the news hub. This is where all the magic happens. All the breaking news comes through here. National news, international news. This is the power triumvirate. They all are down here. These screens up here, the top one tracks how many people are reading any WSJ.com story at any time. Bottom one tracks the production of the newspaper. It's color coded so you know where any page stands at any point in time. And in the morning, you get these. We are the largest U.S. daily newspaper with an average circulation of, let me see if I can remember this, 2,378,827. Count them. Well, let's go see where I film lunch break, right over there. It's Thursday, May 30th, 2013. Welcome to Lunch Break. I'm Wendy Bounds. Today, we are filming cues. Hi, guys. This is our set. Six cameras. We've got all our guests. They come up here. Teleprompter, return feed. This is our Pulitzer Prize wall. Now, you'll often see a lot of the new reporters, the young reporters, kind of coming along here and sort of dreaming. Maybe one day, the Wall Street Journal was very proud to win its 35th Pulitzer just recently. We went to Brett Stevens for commentary. In 2002, the Wall Street Journal South Asia Bureau Chief Daniel Pearl, he was kidnapped and murdered by Al-Qaeda while reporting a story in Pakistan. The Wall Street Journal erected this sculpture in his honor. It's kind of a refuge here in the office. And it's also a reminder that no matter how big we get and how many other topics we may cover, that there are journalists all over the world every day putting their lives on the line to bring us the news. about this staircase. It was actually used in the filming of the movie The Devil Wears Prada. This is our News Corp Cafe by day, disco by night. The food is good here, so good in fact, that people actually call down and they reserve their sandwiches ahead of time. This is very serious and you have to respect the rules. One time I tried to cajole these guys out of a sandwich. I was like flirting and winking and everything. I'm like, who can be that important? You cannot give me this sandwich. And they're finally like, it's for Rupert Murdoch. How many tweets did you send out in the last hour? Come on, tell the truth. Cubes, you guys gotta get out of here. We're on deadline. Now go! Seriously, we're a newspaper. I'll invite you to the dinner party. Hope you like Cracker Jacks. They're good. Really, I got this toy surprise. Right here. Toy surprise in the pack. Go. 